everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use MotionX style reading software on PC to read any wireless device we have for dimensional measurement. We have three blue dials here, and we are going to go through how to connect them to a PC. First, you have to go to MotionX website, and under the More tab, go to the Download section. Scroll down to the software section and download the latest version of our dial reading software. After it has finished downloading, run the software. In order to run the software, you must have the Bluetooth dongle for the PC. This is an optional piece you must order from our online store. Connect it and hit refresh on the software screen. The COM port will show up, although the number will be different from ours. Attach it and then it is connected. Let's go back to the blue dial. Make sure all of the gauges are on, the gauge itself as well as the Bluetooth transmitter on the back. Click Scan. You will find the gauges. Select them and click Connect. You will then be able to see all the readings on your PC. There are two modes, single and continuous. In single capture mode, you will capture data every time you press the capture button. In continuous mode, you can record data continuously. Once you are done, press stop and then you can export the data as a CSV file or save to your computer. You can also zero your dial remotely from your computer without even touching the indicator. Simply click the zero button to zero out the reading. Max, mean, and TIR are shown here. You can also go to the settings feature to set a new sampling rate. The sampling rate for these gauges can vary from 10 samples a second to 1 sample an hour. From the settings, you can also export data to Excel. You can have a timestamp and device name or disable them. One of the major features of this system is that you can have this software in the background. Go to Excel or any text editing software and these settings can be directly pushed to them as a keyboard entry. You can change the settings to this feature here as well, such as putting them in a column or a row. You can enable auto export into Excel. Let us show you the first option, single mode. In single mode, while the software is running, go to Excel. When you press F9, it will show readings from each dial. Next, we are going to go into continuous mode and enable auto export. Make sure the sampling rate is not too high. We selected one sample per second. Go back to continuous mode and start recording. If you go to Excel, you can now see it is continuously pushing data into Excel. All that is necessary is running our software in the background. For any questions, visit our website at motionx.com or contact us, and we'll be happy to help you. And thank you for watching.